Boji, where are you going? <laughs> we were thinking of the same thing. I'm going on an adventure. <laughs> that was wonderful. Yeah, yeah, we I, truly are brothers. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, welcome everyone. We're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And, and we're here for Ranking of Bizarre Kings. Adventure, That's episode right. one. <laughs> y yes, but yeah. episode four of Ranking of Kings. Right, right, exactly. Yeah. Oh welcome my god. I, I, <laughs> it's it's such a good comparison. It's too. great. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah. yep, yep. Yeah, some things uh, happened. Mm -hmm. There was a very different kind of call to action. Yeah. But now he's going. Mm -hmm. He's on his adventure. On the road again. He will not ever, never been on the road. Yeah. Yeah. So now. Sing with me, Dumas. Oh, yeah. no. Okay. So, so now he gets to go on this adventure. Yep. Find maybe Kage, hopefully. Yeah. Um, going with two uh, people that I don't trust fully. Nope. Entirely. Yeah. Um, but I, I give them I give them uh, some good odds of having some really impactful things happen to Boji that will change him yep. and yep. help him grow mm -hmm. into a wonderful king. That's right. But speaking of wonderful kings, we don't have one back home. Dida is um, going full Joffrey. And Bos is dead. And Bos is dead. He's fucking dead. A yeah. fucking demon came out of him. Uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> Pointed at Boji in a very and intimidating... And laughed maniacally. And laughed maniacally. And left. Okay. And then there's the whole mirror thing. And there's the fact that Dida has, you know, issued hits on other people that, you know, he didn't like. And now maybe because his mother sent away the person that is his half-brother that he also wanted to kill, mm -hmm. maybe she's not entirely safe either. Uh, but also Bevan got <laughs> fucking speared with the haft of a spear. Yeah, so it might not have been deep enough to kill him. Yeah. And he did get taken by the snakes. By well, we didn't see snakes. We didn't see snakes, but it might have been snakes. It probably was snakes. Yeah. So, y'all, without further ado, let's get into this. Oh, we're starting with this for the episode. Oh, shit. Okay. Huh. Are we going to get to go know Domas? I don't trust him. <laughs> In the, the same smile yeah. as Boji. A thousand push-ups! I mean, theoretically, Boji could be good at those because his body's so small. Can't do one. Mm. Mm. Awesome. Oh. oh. Okay. <laughs> He doesn't want to fail the king. Right. But thus, he kind of has because he's being forced to train mm -hmm. in a way that doesn't work for, mm -hmm. for him. Yeah. Just teaching him sign language. Mm -hmm. Cool. No. Mm. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Ah. Oh. 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 Okay. What the fuck? All what right. His own training. Oh. My son. Yeah. That's my boy. Right. <laughs> and why would you bring that up now? Because <laughs> I'm evil. <laughs> okay. You better, son of a bitch. Okay. That was very aptly timed <sighs> to have that all before the OP. Right. And after all of this stuff, we were like, we're not sure we trust Dumas, you know? Yeah. And then they have that. Oh, man, but now I'm just thinking of end of Harry Potter 4. Like, as far as, like, movie cries of anguish and stuff. I know. That's peak. Yeah. I'll have to rewatch the OP, but I think I just got a bit of symbolism that they were trying to... Yeah. Set up there with that little brief flash of a bunch of images, but I'll have to I'll have to sit on it a little bit more, give it a good old study. Ah, okay. immediately. I wonder if they're done annually. Uh oh, it's, it's not Boji's fault. It's... Oh. 
Wait, what? It's gonna eat his heart or something? Well, no, that's the devil, clearly. Obtaining power from his body. Right. Hmm. <laughs> Roll credits. Ah, they had to test the knights. <laughs> gotcha. Okay. Wow, a wish, basically? Oh. Uh, oh. Alright. From God. Oh. It's just Gilgamesh's Gates of Babylon. They open it up. And... It's so cute. So if the assassination order has already been given, is it one of these two is with him? No, I think I think Domas is gonna protect him. I think Domas is in the camp where he doesn't think he's fit to be king, hmm. but he would never betray him. Sure. But I could see since that was a soldier that volunteered. Yeah. You know. Yeah, maybe. Like. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hmm. I think he might be about to get robbed. Yeah. <laughs> Thinks he's not knocked out. <laughs> okay, this guy's not an assassin. Yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> Pickpocketed. Yep. Or no, the guy probably just asked him for it. Yeah, they both dropped the ball, yeah. Uh-huh. You should stay with him, yeah. Right. Interesting. Oh. <laughs> well, shit. Yep. Not much they can do. Wanting strength, and then, oh, hey. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. It's <laughs> oh shit! The oh really? Wait. What if Kage was following, and yeah. when it got stolen, he stole it back, or he just killed the guy? And took right. it. Boji. Whoa! Oh my god! He's small enough. <laughs> <laughs> if only Kage were here. Mm. No way. Ooh. Ooh. What? How does crown? this guy have a crown? <laughs> oh, I'm a the king, king that lost the their minds. Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah. Ah! You're very good at this. Oh, indeed. Oh. Shit. <laughs> food is food. Yep. What? Sorry, but what? A soul eater? What? It's a god? It reincarnates? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh, King Bos left his body. Ah, okay. And what came out was a demon devil thing. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. Oh, this is all connected, maybe. Yeah, and now eat. 
Mm. Oh shit. And if all the number one kings are having their essence ripped from them, sure. Something could be getting empowered by oh. that. Oh, uh, what? Uh, Wait a uh, minute. Hold, hold up a minute. Well, that's terrifying. That, that turned around real quick. And hey, he just, <laughs> he just dips. There's a crazy king up there. <laughs> yeah, let's just. Leave. He was scary. <laughs> well, this is a. Um, okay. This is a bit. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Oh, here are some assassins okay. to come and kill him. What if it's Kage? There's no way Kage would actually go after Boji. No, but but what if they poisoned the meat? <laughs> sure. No, they they nah nah, nah. They're, they're not trying to kill Boji by now. <gasps> yeah. Nope. No. Nope. No. Nope. Holy shit! Yeah, oh, that shit, dude. I called don't it. trust that dude. I called it. No, I think this guy is not sure about it. Oh. Because it definitely wasn't Domas, because if the food is poisoned... No, it might have been. Well, mm. That's why he's, like, not saying that he knew it was Bebin. Because then he could try and build the story that oh. Bebin was trying to kill them. He's hiding that. Yeah, Domas was trying to kill him just there. Because an assassin wouldn't miss like that. Yeah. No, yeah, the assassin hit what they were targeting, which is the me. Yeah. Oh, sure, sure. Uh, yeah, hell, why not? Okay. <laughs> They're stuck in a state of limbo? Hmm. Okay. Yeah, separate from the group, please. Wow. Damn. Oh my god. He but just he wants could, it to look like an accident. I guess, because he could kill him easily. You little shit. Yeah. Who are we to question the orders? Please say that was what his in his mind he thought about. He didn't actually do it, did he? He actually did it. Holy shit. That bitch. That bastard. And he laughs? Probably because he feels free now. Sure. Oh. Oh. Oh, Fuck. Well, there's no way he's dead. Immediately. This feels like some Empire Strikes Back cave stuff. Oh. That's a hell of a dream. That was, oh, oh, that was a nightmare. Of course he does. Just make a deal with me. Oh my god, the world is just yeah. Oh, crazier and crazier. We're crazier. ending it there? Wow. No, no. You son of a bitch. Oh my god. I got something for you, show. <laughs> Domas, that little shit. Ah, and I, here I was trying to make a case for him this episode. I was trying so they, hard they to be start like, with that backstory. Like, even if Boji's alive, unless Kage Boji's somehow alive. like, no, no, right. But like, even if, unless Kage like somehow like helped him cling to the edge or something and they climb out later, 
What, is he just gonna be in hell for the next, like, arc of the story? Like, I don't know! <laughs> Soon we'll learn that Boji is half demon, and then he actually is, like, you know... See, he went to the, the super heroic level dungeon or whatever to train like crazy and then come back later. He's gonna get a lot of XP from there. Exactly. All right. Holy shit. Damas. We just got a whole you, bunch of this episode again. Like, the, the, like I, I, this show just keeps giving us a I whole knew just dump. Yeah, yeah, we both did. But this episode, I, I feel so duped because I was sus of him, like, immediately. We both were. Mm -hmm. And then this episode... Maybe not like, the very first episode. Well, like, pretty early. Well, oh, no, yeah, no. Because no, even in the early. first episode, it, it was more of a thing of, like, oh, he's just He feels held back, you know. Right, right. Now, now, we're like, oh, I mean, I, I was like, come on, I I, I want to believe They give I the sweet backstory at the yeah, very beginning. Yeah. But then it's like the, ah, uh, no, but talking about uh, orders? No, 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 that's... Uh, don't don't question them. You know it's not your place, right? The pressures that everyone else has to deal with, you just <sighs> go with it. You know. Mm -hmm. Oh my God! And you and you sick bastard! Like he, he he he's thinking of you when he gives you extra food. And you know what's really scary about this? What? We don't know entirely, entirely, mm -hmm. whether Queen Healing was involved in this or not. That's true. That's true. Because. She might have just had that feeling mm -hmm. of, oh shit, because it was not that she was surprised that she wasn't going to see Boji again, but it was that because she's doing this horrible thing, she might not see her son again either. Well, yeah, I mean, because the Dida, Dida seemed to be the one that wanted Boji dead. Right. Not as much healing, but healing was the one who gave him permission to go on the trip and everything. Which seems counterproductive to what king wanted well right and she was also the one that was saying that Dida should be the the new king so mm -hmm. so okay but, but okay but yeah i i think i think the i think the explanation that seems the most direct yes. is that Dida ordered the assassination because mm -hmm. he was the one that was actively talking about it yeah and he he figured that he could get damas to do it <sighs> so okay <laughs> there you go but but Boji's got someone looking out for him. Yeah, so much world building and little character things all mm -hmm. happening right now. So, at the very least, Bebin has directly influenced the saving of Boji. our boy Bo Boji here. Right. But that doesn't necessarily mean that he was the one that threw those knives. Nope. We know that Kage is tasked with a duty. And it would make sense that if there were to be someone that Domas wouldn't... Like, he's like, oh, Bebin's out there. Where is he? He goes out to look, can't find anybody. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, if it's a shadow. If it's a shadow, you would never find you'd him. You'd never find him. No. And it makes sense that, like, Bebin would, because of the kind of dude that he is, he would actually know how to maybe locate a shadow, you know? But for everybody else, it's just, no, that's not going to happen. Like, well, that's the thing. The reason why Bebin is so good is because of his snakes. Uh, he has right, his other too. skills, of course, mm -hmm. but Bebin's hurt. Right, he's not the one yeah. out here. It's Realistically, Kage. there's no way that, that it's Bebin. Yeah, yeah, very, very mm. little reason. Yep. Also, uh, Appius coming back mm -hmm. and having that little encounter with the ranking of kings, um, kind of emissary, right? Who he throws some barbs at for being like, "Hey, is the rumor that the item that the uh, number one king gets out of the divine vault or what have you?" Uh huh always the same item and it keeps getting passed from king to king and it might drive them crazy and it might drive them mad yeah like hmm. the, and then we find a mad king mm -hmm. out in the middle of the forest yep trapping like, animals and kids for food I, and then he tells stories about how soul essence transfer works well, and not just stories we fucking see, we some, see some some thing, thing yeah that, like the okay the name of this show is Ranking of Kings. Yeah. The first episode that we got. That's a very straightforward episode. The most supernatural out there thing is that apparently there's this dude called Kage who's a shadow. And and the king is kind of a massive Herculean sure, force but, of nature that but the, defeated an army of monsters by himself. Right. But theoretically, that could just be a One Piece thing where it's like, ah, yes, he's super badass. So he, uh, naturally, and he's, a giant, he's 19 you know. feet tall, even if he isn't actually a giant. Or sure. maybe he is, you know. Yeah. 
Right, okay, but now we're getting into shit where it's like, all right, so gods and insanity and and, and, and hell. hell and things like that. Like, wait, when did we step into Dorohidoro? I thought this was like a fun this like is just children's a high fantasy, book, Jake. you know? Yeah I, yeah, I guess. Like, yeah. holy shit. Yeah. I, so, so, uh -huh. um, while our main boy fell into the gates of hell, yeah, we have yet to realize that he is clearly also half demon because his father uh, released his true essence when he died. Right, that might have just been his soul. Not might have been his soul, and that he wasn't a great person. He was actually just a devil. Well, so one of the things, okay, I don't know how um, technically any of this could potentially be tied into the world building and things like that, but thematically, mm -hmm. there seems to be this this commentary on the idea of what true strength means. Yes. Because you've got uh, uh, Boji and uh, Daida, who both are different examples of that, but then you also have Damas, and I think Damas is one of the more key examples because yeah. he is he is the sword master, right? He's, he's meant to train he, in the way of strength. Exactly, yeah. and and he specifically emulated the king, who, if strength were all that was required for the ranking of kings, would have been number one, right? right. But oh wait, then he does super scummy shitbag stuff like this, right? What's the like there's there's a disconnect. Yeah, Damas, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Damas. There, yeah, not the king. Yeah. I think it's the idea that there's a genuine aspect to Boji that allows him to connect with people in an mm -hmm. emotional and powerful way that most of the other characters can't do because they're all two faced. Most of them have some okay. kind of false aspect of them sure. that they put up for others mm -hmm. and they have their true nature hidden within. In some ways their essence is contradictory right. to the way they live their life. Mm-hmm. So therefore, if they were to die, the essence that would come out of them wouldn't necessarily be gorgeous, pretty, and pure. Sure. Well, and also, um, if Bos was a demon, mm -hmm. right, what we saw of him was a very kind person. Yeah, for, for the, the most, most part, part. You know, like like we did like we didn't see him being a particular jerk. I, like I would say we didn't see much of him at all. Okay, that's that's fair. Because yeah, we didn't, right? It, we he, didn't really. Yeah, but it like he seemed to care about his son, you know, like but, like only sick monsters don't care about. Well, their okay, kids. no, that's fair. Darth Vader cares about his kid, you know, no, like right. <laughs> but like, I guess, hmm. If the if uh if it if the demon that left. Boss's body mm -hmm. was actually Boss, like 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 he was actually a demon in disguise or something like that, or you know like or it was like, something possessing him, giving right. him that strength. He yeah, to deal exactly. With. Right, so, you know maybe something similar to what Dida is about to do. You know, um, that's. I feel like that's touching on the question of the there's the acquisition of strength. There's the what are you going to do with the strength that you either were, are born with or cultivate yourself or are given from something else. And that maybe it doesn't have to adhere to the form that one would assume. Domas is the person that we would assume from the get-go that we would be able to trust. He is the he is the knight of the king and he is the trainer of Boji and all of that Domas? stuff. Domas? Yeah, but okay. then he does something like this where he pushes him off a cliff. Bebin, he is the one that that, you know, oozes like don't trust this guy he's got all the sussy vibes and everything and yes he did go to kill um uh Appius, yeah but he also helped make sure that boji would stay alive yeah. right so there's there you know there's there's contradictions yeah. going there the I, contradictions I can go both directions you i know? think the theme is a lot simpler it's yeah. just that the world isn't black and white sure the world isn't simple it's right. complicated. People are complicated. Right. Domas is Healing not a is horrible person. No, 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 straight up. What's the difference between him and Bebin? Bebin wasn't ordered to kill Boji. If Bebin was ordered to kill Boji, I think he might do it. But the thing was, he wasn't. He was ordered to go kill Appius. The difference is that Domas, if Domas was ordered to kill anyone, he would do it. The mm -hmm. only person that really, really, so far, that has like a good nature in them towards Boji implicitly is Kage. Kage specifically, specifically, multiple times has the opportunity to 
do him in right and doesn't just for his clothes because he's going to you know exploit him there Mm -hmm. but then seeing the ways in which they're similar through the connection that he has right he wants to be his ally he wants to help him in in, in most in in whatever way he can but domas and this guy here this other you know nincompoop whatever Mm -hmm. are ordered to kill boji and i think the complicated aspect of this is that we don't know what would happen truly if if um uh bevin was ordered to kill boji right yeah i mean sure yeah uh yeah i i think there's a decent possibility that it was just domas that was ordered to kill boji yeah and that's why he specifically sent the other guy away yeah but Mm -hmm. um yeah it's it's something where hmm this show keeps expanding and mm-hmm. I and I wasn't expecting it to mm-hmm. like like not because I thought it was, you know, like not as not as like a um, derogatory kind of thing, but yeah. just like a I was expecting this to be a very simple kind of storybook, you know, like like wonderful, sweet story. And now it's going into like all this complicated, like serious stuff. And I'm like, wait, holy shit. Like th- what 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 do we have here? Like, I, I feel like it's something where I'm I'm understanding the 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 story in some ways less as it goes on because I'm realizing how small of a piece of the entire thing we have right now. Right. Yeah. You know, we're just beginning. Yeah. 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 So, um, with what we've got, we now have, Mm -hmm. um, Kage most likely following him under orders from Bevan to keep the King safe, to keep, well, the Prince safe. Mm -hmm. Um, we have now, uh, Dida getting a premonition of sorts, of something negative happening, but that Boji is his last little bit of hope. Right. And then we have uh, him going down into this depths of a cellar dungeon thing yep. to gain the power of Bose's body. Right. Which probably involves something ritualistic. We'll have to see how that goes. But, all right. The world building and the ways in which we had these little conveniences set up to give us the audience a very puzzle piece esque kind of um, piece of like um, uh, picture of the <laughs> world itself means that we have now a mechanic for how the essence and or the soul, the nature of a person, is something that comes out when they die. Right, and that's something that is usually probably Mm -hmm. recycled by this deity supernatural entity right and then reincarnates into yep other beings now this might just apply to animals this might just apply to animals but you know humans totally aren't animals or anything well well not only that we literally had the essence of something come out of Bose, Mm -hmm. and it took the form of a demon oh yeah well and and the the whole conversation of like ah yes eating the thing to gain its strength and then oh yeah how do we gain the king's strength Mm -hmm. well i wonder yeah these are being introduced at the same time given that this is the same method very intentional they had a very random exposition bit from apius to then having a mad king later on the episode yep the writing style is very apparent in that regard Mm -hmm. so we are left in the dark here how is boji going to survive what is Dida going to actually do? I will Bevan reveal himself, or will reveal that it was Kage, and Kage panicked seeing what was going on, and mm-hmm. Kage caught Boji on the way down I, the yeah, pit. I think it's going to be a Kage caught Boji kind of a deal, mm-hmm. um, and it would make sense, like especially if it's Kage. I mean, we can. It, it's Kage, right? It's Kage, because um, Bevan definitely isn't over there. Yeah. Um, yeah, if anything, he just probably gave him the weapons necessary. Right, right, exactly. He's like, here's my armory. Eat yep. whatever you need, because yep. I Take know how your, your your shadow people work, where you can store things in yourself, right. like a little bag of holding. You go know? go and make sure that whoever the assassin is, they don't they don't get Boji. Mm-hmm. Um, visually, you can have Kage not be shown and have that work, because, of course, Domas isn't going to see him because he's a shadow, so you can have Kage kind of just appear, right? Mm-hmm. And, and be like, oh, yeah, I... I got you, you know, and, and it, it will like that. There's a reason for it to, to be. Right. We were getting Domas' perspective for the most part. Anyway. Exactly. It's the benefit of having a character that can understand, you know, human speech being the main character where they can have these conversations, essentially expositing to the audience, what they're thinking and feeling 
because they don't have to share that with the main character unless they're mm -hmm. using sign language. Right. There you go. Yeah. But uh, if Boji does end up in hell, uh, that the thing is, I could see that happening. With I the, could see that With the happening. way that this show has been like peeling back the onion and everything so far, I feel like it's not too far out there. If you had asked me it's two episodes ago, I would have been like, ha, that's a good one. No right. way. Right. But now... It's it, it's up in the air. It's up in the air. Yeah, you know, so like Boji is on the way uh, down to hell. Yeah. God damn it. So, all right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below for our Patreon. You can get an early access there. You can watch full length timer reactions there, and all this comes with Discord access. So you can chat with us in the community there about this show, about anime in general, and also be sure to check out our Twitch channel. We stream every weekday. The info's in the description. Yeah. So if any of that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then. Or semblance of sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next time. time.